All right, good morning, Winger Park World. So it is day four of Read Across America Week, and it is Crazy Sock Day, which is exciting for me because I get to read to you an awesome book, one of my favorite, Fox in Socks. And if you don't know much about this book, just wait, because this is a great read, great read aloud. Uh, and you can actually see it says, this is a book you read aloud to find out just how smart your tongue is. The first time you read it, don't go too fast. This fox is a tricky fox. He'll try to get your tongue in trouble. So let's find out. Oh, take it slowly. This book is dangerous. Fox and Socks by Dr. Seuss. Fox, Socks, Box, Knox. Knox and Box. Fox and Socks. Knox on Fox and Socks in Box. Socks on Knox and Knox in Box. Fox and Socks on Box on Knox. Chicks with Bricks come. Chicks with Blocks come. Chicks with Bricks and Blocks and Clocks come. Look, sir. Look, sir. Mr. Knox, sir. Let's do tricks with Bricks and Blocks, sir. Let's do tricks with Chicks and Clocks, sir. First, I'll make a quick trick brick stack. Then, I'll make a quick trick block stack. You can make a quick trick chick stack. You can make a quick trick clock stack. And here's the new tricks, Mr. Knox. Socks on chicks and chicks on fox. Fox on clocks on bricks and blocks. Bricks and blocks on knocks on box. Now we come to ticks and tocks, sir. Try to say this, Mr. Knox, sir. Clocks on fox tick. Clocks on Knox talk. Six, six bricks tick. Six, six chicks talk. Please, sir. I don't like this trick, sir. My tongue isn't quick or slick, sir. I get all those ticks and clocks, sir, mixed up with the chicks and talks, sir. I can't do it, Mr. Fox, sir. I'm so sorry, Mr. Knox, sir. Please, sir, I don't like this trick, sir. My tongue isn't quick or slick, sir. I get all those ticks and clocks, sir, mixed up with all the chicks and talks, sir. I can't do it, Mr. Fox, sir. Here's an easy game to play. Here's an easy thing to say. New socks, two socks, whose socks, Sue's socks. Who sews whose socks? Sue sews Sue's socks. Who sees who sew? Whose new socks, sir? You see Sue sew Sue's new socks, sir. That's not easy, Mr. Fox, sir. Who comes? Crow comes. Slow Joe Crow comes. Who sews crow's clothes? Sue sews crow's clothes. Slow Joe Crow sews whose clothes? Sue's clothes. Sue sews so socks of fox in socks now. Slow Joe Crow sews so knocks in box now. Sue sews so rose on slow Joe's Joe Crow's clothes. Fox sews so hose on slow Joe Crow's nose. Hose goes, rose grows, nose hose goes some. Crows rose grows some. Mr. Fox, I hate this game, sir. This game makes my tongue quite lame, sir. Oh, Mr. Knox, sir, what a shame, sir. We'll find something new to do now. Here is lots of new blue goo now. New goo, blue goo, gooey gooey, blue goo, new goo, gluey gluey. Gooey goo for chewy chewing. That's what that goo, goo goose is doing. Do you choose to chew goo too, sir? If, sir, you, sir, chur, choose to chew, sir, with the goo goose, chew, sir, do, sir. Mr. Fox, sir, I won't do it. I can't say it. I won't chew it. Very well, sir. Step this way. We'll find another game to play. Bim comes. Ben comes. Bim brings Ben broom. 
Ben brings Bim Broom. Ben bends Bim's broom. Bim bends Ben's broom. Bim's bends. Ben's bends. Ben's bent broom breaks. Bim's bent broom breaks. Ben's band. Bim's band. Big bands. Pig bands. Bim and bed lead bands with brooms. Ben's band bangs and Bim's band booms. Pig band, boom band, big band, broom band. My poor mouth can't say that. No, sir. My poor, poor mouth is much too slow, sir. Well, then, bring your mouth this way. I'll find it something it can say. Luke, luck, likes, lakes. Luke's duck, lick, likes, lakes. Luke, luck, licks, lakes. Luke's duck, licks, lakes. Duck takes licks and lakes. Luke, luck, likes. Luke, luck, takes licks and lakes. Duck, likes. I can't blab such a blibber blabber blubber. My tongue isn't made of rubber. Mr. Knox, now, come now, come now. You don't have to be so dumb now. Try to say this, Mr. Knox, please. Through three cheese trees, three free fleas flew. Well, these fleas flew, freezy breeze blew. Freezy breeze made these three trees freeze. Freezy trees made these trees cheese freeze. That's what made these three free fleas sneeze. Stop it! Stop it! That's enough, sir. I can't say such silly stuff, sir. Very well then, Mr. Knox, sir. Let's have a little talk about Tweedle Beetles. What do you know about Tweedle Beetles? Well, when Tweedle Beetles fight, it's called a Tweedle Beetle battle. And when they battle in a puddle, it's a Tweedle Beetle puddle battle. And when Tweedle Beetles battle with paddles in a puddle, they call it a Tweedle Beetle puddle paddle battle. And when Beetles battle Beetles in a puddle paddle battle, and the beetle battle puddle is a puddle in a bottle. They call this a Tweedle Beetle Buddle Bottle Puddle Paddle Battle Muddle. And when beetles fight these battles in a bottle with their paddles, and the bottle's on a poodle, and the poodle's eating noodles. They call this a muddle puddle Tweedle Poodle. Beetle, noodle, bottle, paddle, battle, and now wait a minute, Mr. Sox Fox. When a fox in, is in the bottle where the Tweedle Beetles battle with their paddles in a puddle on a noodle eating poodle, this is what they call a Tweedle Beetle Noodle Poodle. Bottled, paddled, muddled, duddled, fuddled, waddled, fox and socks, sir. Fox and socks, our game is done, sir. Thank you for a lot of fun, sir. Now, is your tongue numb? Well, is it? I read it. Mine is. But here's what I want you to think about. Is there something you thought you might not be great at? And then you tried it? And you were actually pretty good at it? But the whole time up to it, maybe you didn't want to do it? Talk about that as a class. See what you come up with. Share your stories about times where you might not have thought you could do something. But then once you did it, you were like, wow, I'm really good at this. All right, well, this is Mr. M signing off. Have an awesome day. Be wolf ready. And go wolves.